the reason you hear those people out there saying some of the things that they say is because when you make comments like, we're going to put a lot of coal miners out of jobs, these are the kind of people that you're affecting. This is, this is my family. And while my hope is in God, that's my future. I just want to know how you can say you're going to put a lot of coal miners out of, out of jobs and then come in here and tell us how you're going to be our friend because those people out there don't see you as a friend. I know that, Bo. And, you know, I am i don't know how to explain it other than what I said was totally out of context from what I meant because I have been talking about helping coal country for a very long time. And I did put out a plan last summer. And it was a misstatement because what I was saying is that the way things are going now, we will continue to lose jobs. What I said was that is going to happen unless we take action to try to help and prevent it. So I, I, don't, I don't mind anybody being upset or angry. That's a perfect right for people to feel that way. I do feel a little bit sad and sorry that I gave folks the reason or the excuse to be so upset with me because that is not what I intended at all. You know, I'll be honest with you, a lot of people said, just don't go to West Virginia, right? You know, go to California. There are a lot more votes there. I know that my chances are, you know, pretty difficult, to be honest. I'm here because I want you to know whether people vote for me or not, whether they yell at me or not, is not going to affect what I'm going to try to do to help because I feel like that's a moral obligation. Important to point out, uh, the Clinton campaign says that they were not prepared for that question. That was an organic moment. And they reiterate what you heard Secretary Clinton say there, which is that 